Sunday afternoon, it started a fire at a home in Midtown on G Street, where these two young women lived. Was 20 minutes into my nap when I heard our smoke alarm going off in the house. And then I just like turned around and there were like flames. Mackenzie Chapman was sleeping when she woke up and ran out, texting her roommate and best friend Devin to come home. I saw a text that said our house is on fire. I'm not joking. And I read it and I was like, what the heck? It was a second alarm fire, three buildings involved and many people displaced. This is serious. It's not just like a microwave or a toaster. It's a real, real fire on our block. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but no one can go back home. This loss comes on the heels of a car crash for the two roommates. They shared this car and they were rear-ended on the freeway the week prior. This is what puts people on the street. Like losing your car and a home in a week is like, and it's just great like that we have people that have surrounded us and like seriously there's got to be angels like God is like doing something crazy. And now they want to help their neighbors. One lost everything in the fire and also lost two cats. Now one cat is missing, Leo. She lost a lot in that fire and like her biggest loss would definitely be like her cat. Going through the unthinkable puts it all into perspective. In one hand, yeah, we lost a lot, but in another hand, we're like, At we least, keep, yeah. we're still here, so.